let me uh, caution you that these are all estimates. Tulsa City Councilors say an estimate of 15 to 17 million dollars is not good enough. They want a specific dollar amount for how much it will cost to buy trash carts using tax dollars. It's kind of like going to the bank when you're buying a car and you don't know what car you're buying yet and you don't know where you're going to get it and you don't know how much it's going to cost, but you at least get a loan approval amount for, like, can I have $50,000? Well, I may buy a Camry, not a Lexus. To get all those details, today they decided to set up a panel made up of four counselors and tear board members. You all need to understand uh, where these numbers came from and, and, and why we think we have this particular number assigned to something. I think that's great. Let's get together. Councilor Phil Lakin says his constituents just want to know if their $13 monthly charge will increase. This is what it's going to cost um, with the lowest bidder, the mid bidder, and the high bidder compared to what it costs today. Tear officials say they cannot talk on camera due to pending litigation. However, Councilor Ewing says Tear was hoping a contract would be awarded by now. And if they go with a contract in which the city buys the carts, residents would save money. That's because the city doesn't pay sales tax. There's a lot of work that has to be done for new haulers to come in. And so uh, that time frame isn't the tear board trying to force something. It's simple logistics of a new hauler having to get their operations set up by, by the middle of the summer.